Oh, check it out. It's the pool. It's the pool, guys. Uh, it's 44 degrees, 1.40 p.m. on Sunday. Um, if it were about 30 degrees warmer, with this amount of sunshine, this would be an awesome pool day. Maybe not. Maybe it wouldn't be. Maybe if it were 30 degrees warmer, but that's not going to happen in February. I'll give you a better view this time as I rant for a couple seconds. Actually, I'm not really ranting. Just headed back over to the grandparents' house today. The weather's actually nice today, so I can drive this. Um, I'm gonna go over and program the garage door opener to their their um, their home link, their, their garage door head, so I don't have to use their little remote in my glove box anymore. Uh, and I'm gonna pick up my sunglasses, my other glasses, the Oakley uh, radars, which I left over there yesterday. But uh, it's a pretty nice day, so I'll go do that and uh, maybe we'll do something with Canon or somebody tonight. And I made a lot of changes to the Final Cut Pro document that I've been working with to edit these vlogs. Mike was over yesterday, we were looking at it, and we couldn't figure out why the document was 720p and 23.94 frames per second. So I made a new, doc a new Canvas document that is 720p and um, 60 frames per second. So the video files are going to be bigger, but it's going to be much higher quality, which should be nice. Let me know if you see a difference. I'm going to go in through the um, Silver Lake Estates over here. We're going to go past that house that has the E39 um, 530 and the Black M5. I think it's a Black M5 and a Titanium Silver 530 or vice versa. And uh, we'll see if he's got either of them out. I haven't seen either of them since fall. He's got um, a Jeep or some, something like that that I've seen out of the corner of my eye that he drives in the winter, but it's so nice out here. The roads are pretty clean. There's really not much salt. They did not salt yesterday. This is just the oddest winter. You know, it snows for a day and then it rains and now we have uh, 42 degrees and, and sun. So strange, but I'll take it over last year when we had the most snow and the most cold weather we had had in years. All right, here's the house. Looks like it is uh, all closed up. Nobody's home. All right, yeah, 240. Uh, I just got that all done. Oh, there's this guy. I'm going past this house again because this is how I go home. Uh, he's got a Chevy out there. Looks like a Tahoe or some big Suburban or something. Anyways, uh, 240. I got the garage door program. That was easy. They had pie, so couldn't help myself with that. And I got my other glasses, which I was going to wear now, but they're in the trunk. So I'm just going down Silver Lake Boulevard. This is before the houses start on the left because this is where Silver Lake is. For the user that asks, why is it called Silver Lake? There she blows. And here's an interesting fact. Both of these houses burned down. This one more recently, completely burned to the ground. It's gone. That one burned down two years ago and they rebuilt that place in there, which is nice. And I like this one here. This guy has a BMW Z4. Uh, it's a pretty big house, kind of close to the street. It definitely needs some more landscaping to soften that up before it would be nicer. Uh, this looks so much better in the spring, though. I'll film more then. Ah, uh, the guy with the BMW M3. There's my grandfather's favorite place around here because it's got excellent proximity to the lake and the, the one of the two Silver Lake Country Clubs that there are. Actually, this isn't really a country club. This is just a boathouse that they're going to rebuild and volleyball. This is where we had those picnics in the summer. You probably remember that, maybe, and that's where we fish. What? Uh, Rolls Rice? Uh, you see that? Friggin' ghost. Nice. This is about the only place around here where I drive very often. This place is close, but I don't drive there very often. That you can look out and see hills like this. And I don't even consider this a hill, for freak's sake. I mean, look. I can see maybe two miles into the outskirts of Hudson here from, I'm still in Stowe, driving north on 91 if you want to find it on Google Maps, just by Leisure Time Swim Club. Anyways, that's it. And I miss California so much, and really anything out west, because no matter where you drive, you look out and you, and you see mountains in the distance, and I love mountains, and I've been to the Caribbean ten times, and each little island is just a little mountain sticking out of the water somewhere, the Caribbean Sea or wherever. Um, and it's great, and now I'm going up that hill and we don't see anything. Everything's so flat. That's something I don't like about living here. I remember going back and watching Shay's vlog. You know, they're in Los, in Los Angeles now. Speaking of Shay, there's a van just like his. But um, you see the mountains uh, in LA, really up uh, Big Bear Mountain. You know, you look up the coast towards um, Malibu and you see mountains up there. There's not as much further south, but there are still mountains. 
Um, but when he was in Idaho, there were a lot more mountains there, and that was nice too. But I like Los Angeles better than Idaho. Right. So it is um, 1043, and maybe if I turn up the screen, you'll see me. Maybe not. I am uh, watching Pawn Stars over here on the History Channel. And uh, this is the new document I've set up. We're in 720p at 60 frames per second. It's going to be a huge file. It's going to take longer to upload. There's Pawn Stars. Uh, but let me know if it's any better. So I'm going to end this now before it gets too long, and I'll talk to you tomorrow on um, Insignificant Day 421. Good night, guys.